Hi, I'm Natalia Villaveses and I'm here for PETA. We really need to understand that every time we go to a supermarket and every time we buy a product, either an animal product, it's a piece of meat or whatever, and we actually pass that through the register, we bought it. Having the chance to watch the video that you guys have in PETA called Meet Your Meat, it was probably one of the first punches. Once I made that connection between loving an animal and eating an animal is when things click in my brain. Latinos have this obsession with everything fried, with a lot of animal protein. And yeah, it's true, we have a lot of problems with obesity. We have a lot of problems with diabetes. We have a lot of problems with asthma. We have a lot of problems with a lot of things that comes from it. And I couldn't believe that to create a toothpaste or to create um, a shampoo, there's a lot of animals that have to suffer for that. As you become a vegan, you start learning that everything in your life have to become cruelty free. From the clothes you wear, from the furniture you have in your house, from the product you use to clean your house. I had the chance to go into the PETA website and actually you guys have a list of the things that are cruelty free, the things that are vegan, the products that are tested on animals, the ones that are not tested on animals. We need to understand that going and buying a puppy is actually really cruel, you know, because the industry that is behind it, the puppy mills. I've been there and it's a terrible situation. One of the things that really touched my heart is to see how people can go to a place and spend thousands of dollars buying a dog on a set to give them the chance, you know, go to a shelter and rescue a life. If we spend, I don't know, $5 buying a coffee in a Starbucks or in Coffee Bean, why don't you use that $5 and give it to PETA or give it to an organization to make a difference? One of the places I think people need to go to is through the PETA website because it's education for, for people that are hungry to learn about animal issues and what's going on. I want things to change and I think PETA is actually doing that, you know, creating change.